Hey there, fellow knowledge enthusiasts. Ever dreamed of stumbling upon a treasure so immense that it could change your life forever? Well, get ready to be captivated by the epic discovery of the largest gold nugget ever found, the legendary Welcome Stranger. But hold on just a moment. Before you dismiss this as just another tale of buried treasure, let me ask you something. Have you ever imagined what it would feel like to unearth a gold nugget so massive that it would make all your financial worries disappear in an instant? If not, you're about to embark on a thrilling journey of discovery it was discovered in 1869 in the state of Victoria, Australia. What's truly remarkable is that it was found at a depth of just one inch, right at the base of a tree. The gold nugget was cut down to a weight of 78. Its actual amount of pure gold, after removing impurities, was 72.2. During that time, they didn't have scales capable of weighing something so heavy, so they had to break the nugget into three pieces using a blacksmith. Sandville. John Deason and Richard Dotes, directly to the Bank of Australia in Dunali. It was then melted down and sent to England. The gold value today is the equivalent of an astonishing $4.3 million. But back in 1869, they received $9,381 for it. In the 1850s, thousands of people traveled to Victoria, Australia, in search of their fortune as part of the Victorian gold rush. They came from different parts of Australia and the world, and many of them were not wealthy. On February 569, however, two Cornish miners' fortunes changed. When John Deason was one year old after his father, a fisherman, passed away. This is where he met Richard Dotes, and both are listed in the 1851 census as working in Cornwall's tin mines. Mr. Deason moved to Australia in 1853, and a year later Mr. Rotes also made the journey to become prospectors or diggers. In 1862, they reached Malaya Gold, and after seven years of working to sustain themselves, the two men struck gold on the slope known as Bulldog Gully. They discovered a massive piece of gold encased in quartz just below the surface. The nugget was so large that Mr. Deason mentioned, I tried to pry the nugget up with the pick, but the handle broke. I then got a crowbar and raised the nugget to the surface. They transported it to the town of Denali, approximately 12 miles, 20 kilometers away, where its weight was measured at the London Chartered Bank. The nugget was immediately broken up, partly because it was too large for the scales. Before a model could be made or photographs taken, a drawing was made based on the memory of those who saw it, and there is now a replica in the Denali Museum. If sold today, it is estimated the nugget would fetch more than 2 million pounds, and it would probably have significant prestige value. On February 569, two Cornish miners discovered the large nugget known as the Welcome Stranger while mining in the gold fields of Victoria, Australia. It weighed 11 stone 72 measured 61 centimeters, 24 inches when discovered buried barely beneath the surface. Descendants of John Deason and Richard Dotes, who were paid slightly under 10,000 pounds, have gathered at the spot where it was located. As part of the celebrations is a themed play in full period costume, and a photo taken at the time has been recreated using the relatives of the two men. It's a fascinating story about two guys who suddenly become fabulously wealthy. In those days that didn't happen, said John Tully from the Goldfields Historical Society. Nowadays we have things like the lotto where people can become millionaires overnight, but back then it didn't happen like that. Susie Deason, 38, is the great-great-great-granddaughter of Mr. Deason and still lives in the area, she said. When people hear my name, they always ask me where the gold is or if I am rich. Unfortunately, I am not, and we haven't even got any jewelry made from the welcome stranger. In the 1850s and 1860s, Malayagol, where the nugget was discovered stuck in the roots of a tree, was a thriving gold rush town with 11 pubs. However, gold speculators are still attracted to the area known as the Golden Triangle, Mrs. Deason mentioned. People come here to try their luck and spend days searching for their fortune and there are still some reasonably sized gold nuggets around, but nothing as big as the welcome stranger. The incredible journey of the welcome stranger, the largest gold nugget ever discovered. If this story left you inspired and in awe of the possibilities that await beneath the Earth's surface, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe for more captivating tales of exploration and discovery.
But before you go, we want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on the legendary Welcome Stranger? Would you dare to embark on a quest for treasure yourself? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for joining us on this thrilling expedition into the world of gold nuggets. Stay curious, stay adventurous.